there's always some drama whenever I ride with Tony. Now, <laughs> I know he's laughing already. He already knows he's in big trouble with me. Peter, you might have somebody who beats you now. Now, we rode the marathon route this morning. You know, we pushed our limits. Oh, let's go to the start line. Let's go to the start line. I was like, I don't know, Tony, I don't know. So anyways, I succumb and I said, okay. We get to close to the start line. They're like, well, you can't, we can't let you in. We can't let you in. So we stop at a police station and they're like, well, you know, go over to where the buses are. They're loading people up and maybe you can put your bikes on and go to the start line. We do that. No, 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 no go, no go. They won't let us in. Let us in. So we come to the train station to catch a train home. Now that, you know, it was almost nine o'clock. We left at 6 a.m. Uh, we get to the train station and train doesn't leave for like two more hours. I'm like, Tony, Tony, come here. The train's not leaving for two hours. So he's like, let's go get some breakfast. And I said, okay, all right. So we go fill up on French toast, home fries, eggs, bacon, sausage. And we come back to the Ashland train station to catch the train. And we're waiting for the train. And all of a sudden the woman comes out and says, no bikes allowed on the train today. It's Marathon Monday. The MBTA has been announcing this for the last week and a half. Where have you been? So now we're 22 miles from home and we have to ride all the way home. So again, whenever I ride with Tony, there's drama. I don't know if I'm riding with Tony anymore. So Lord, just please let us make it home safely. <laughs> Tony, do you have anything you want to add to this? It is what it is. So I've been planning to ride 60 miles and it's all Melanie's fault, okay, because now I'm riding 60 miles even though I hadn't planned on it. So who's bringing the drama to the table? I'll leave you with that question. Bye. All right, and we're going to get out of the way because there's a train coming, <laughs> and I'm sure he's going to be uh, honking his horn soon. But we can't get on these trains because you know, there's no bikes allowed on the train today because it's Marathon Monday. the train without us all right now we'll let you know how it ends at least the weather's nice it did turn out to be a really really good day all right folks we're trying to get back home a lot of the roads we need to travel on are closed but this is uh, i'd much rather be riding home than running home i must say you know how you're driving and you see a cyclist on a road they have no business being on. Well, I'm on one of those roads right now because of Tony. However, we are on the sidewalk. Thank goodness there is a sidewalk. And we're going to be getting off this road very soon. Uh, obviously, a lot of the roads are closed because of the marathon. And because we couldn't put our, tr our bikes on the train, we uh, had to ride back home. So we're safe. We're good. All right, folks, <laughs> you know, we started this process at 6 a.m. this morning. It is now 3.31, and we're about seven miles from home. Yes, we had to truck it back in via bike uh, because we could not put our bike on the train. So I'm a little tired now. I'm a little bit angry with Tony, but I'm trying not to beat him up. I'm just glad we got off of Route 30. Alive. That was a smart idea, go down Glen Road and then... Back into white well, no, okay. Yeah, we got We're off both exhausted. It's, alive. It's a journey, it's an adventure. <laughs>